If it looks like I'm sweating, it's because I am. Because I just had to grab all these t-shirts and throw them out here and check this out. Holy, yep, you guessed it. We've seen them all. We've seen the world's greatest sports hoodie collection. We've seen the world's greatest sports beanie collection, world's greatest sports hat collection, and now it's time for the world's greatest sports t-shirt collection. Check this out. You guys remember what it looked like when we did the hoodies. It was a little bit taller than this. What does that tell you? T-shirts take up a lot less space, and look at this. Let me tell you something, there's not pillows there. They are piled that high. We're gonna show you what it is to have the world's greatest sport teacher collection. And I ask you one thing, how many do you think are here? We're gonna go through and show you a little bit. You know, of course, a couple of my favorite places. Clemson, you've seen that a million times. You know, Syracuse, obviously there's a ton of that. Ugh, Georgia Bulldogs, I can only tell you how many Georgia Bulldogs things I have. Oop, been to LSU a million times. You know, one of the things you gotta remember, if there is a t-shirt in this pile, it is a place that we have been for a live sporting event, whether it's Major League Baseball, uh, football, basketball, minor league hockey. It doesn't matter. If we've been there, it's in here. Uh, a lot of U.S. soccer. We've been to a ton of U.S. soccer games. I think this is my New York Giants. I'm a huge New York Giants fan, even though they're probably one of the worst teams in the NFL right now. We'll turn it around someday. Go dogs! I can't tell you how many. Georgia things I have and North Carolina is another one of my favorites a lot of University of Virginia stuff I mean Virginia Tech Georgia Tech South Carolina the Gamecocks baby if you haven't been to the South Carolina for sandstorm you have not been to a college football game the other place I cannot tell you how many times I've been to Auburn War Eagle one of the greatest places on earth to see a game now the crazy part here is now I got to go through every single one of these and do inventory find out how many t-shirts i really have here even we even got some uh collared shirts here Ooh, florida gators they're about to turn things around a lot of clemson stuff i can already tell that's north carolina syracuse west virginia i mean we got everything here and we even dig way back into here and you want to talk about how much stuff there really is look at this we're going to show you that we are not teasing look we are not teasing there is a lot and lot and lot of t-shirts here we got all of this and we haven't even started the rest of them falling watch i mean it's uh, it's like a sea of stuff falling down we're going to show you how much stuff there there really is here you know it's an endless amount i can't even pick it all up you know just an endless amount of stuff that's here so we're going to go through we're going to organize them put them in their conferences, uh, put them in their divisions, put them in the NFL uh, type of things, and we're going to come back and show you how many there really are. Good luck on your guess. It's higher than you think it is. For those of you who don't think that I fold my own clothes, I got news for you. Check this out. Okay. After a lot of time and hard work, we have actually organized all of the world's greatest sports t-shirt collection. And uh, to show you how much there is, it's pretty incredible. If you've made this area, you're one of my favorite schools. These are the collared shirts. Florida Gators. Arkansas isn't necessarily one of my favorite, but I love them. You know, Clemson, huge. West Virginia, huge. The U back in the day was one of the greatest places ever when they had the Orange Bowl. Obviously, go Cues, hook em horns, Georgia, go dogs. And of course, North Carolina. If you haven't been to North Carolina for basketball, man, you're missing out. And of course, Clemson, again, it's just one of my favorite places. But check this out. Auburn, I got more Auburn t-shirts than you could ever imagine that I've created uh, this pile over the years. So check this out. Here's how we separated them out. <clears throat> SEC dry fit, regular SEC, and yeah, that is a, uh, a big pile. Uh, Major League Baseball, Clemson, Paw Power, there's about 30 Clemson shirts right there. Georgia, go dogs. This pile is nothing but Georgia from top to bottom. How about them dogs? Georgia football, UGA, UGA. South Carolina, man, I got my Party Like a Cockstar shirt down here. Everything, you name it, they're there. Those are all Auburn t-shirts, folks. There's probably 25 or 30 of them there. Here's how we broke it up. All right, the New American Conference is right there. That's the big, uh, big 10 or whatever they call it. I'm not very excited about that one. U.S. Soccer, a little bit of NHL, Major League Soccer. This is the uh, new Sun Belt, NFL. 
This is the ACC, but ACC t-shirts. Back there you have dry fit ACC, NBA. Those are all Syracuse t-shirts from the bottom up. This is uh, basically, you know, you're looking here at the Mountain West. You're looking here at Conference USA, Great Lakes, West Coast. You see how I can get, as I get West, there's less and less. That's all you got for the Pac-12. That's it. I'm not a big Pac-12 guy. More some Southern places. That's a Missouri State. This is uh, the Big 12 dry fit, regular Big 12. And uh, we're going to let you guys contemplate how many shirts there actually are here. I think the number is going to be a little bit higher than you saw last time. And it continues to grow every day. The mystery is now over. I'm sure many of you guessed wrong. But the final number, 518 and growing. And look at that. Auburn won 28 total. Georgia 27 total. Clemson 24. Next below that would have been Syracuse.